Malaysia is famous for its cave temples and many went on to become famous tourist attractions. However, all these caves are found in West Malaysia like the Batu Cave in Selangor and the Sampo Tong and Perak Caves in Ipoh. Meanwhile, across the South China Sea here in Sarawak, there was no cave temple, at least to my knowledge, until recently. Recently, I was informed of the existence of a cave temple in Sarawak and made a visit there. Several questions sprang up in my mind. So, is this the first cave temple of Sarawak? As far as I know, there is no other cave temple in Sarawak so far. And if there is, please do let me know. And where is this first temple that I am talking about? The Paoling San Temple is located in the district of Bao. It is about 40 kilometers from the city of Kuching. This temple was started only about 10 years ago. The story of how the temple was started is quite interesting. Back in 2012, a golden statue of the Buddha was found by some boys in a river in Lundu. It was believed that the statue was brought to Lundu by the tsunami of 2012 from a far away land. At the same time, there was a devotee by the name of Tan searching for a place of worship in Bau area. To cut a long story short, the statue was finally placed in this cave and the rest is history. From then on, as more and more people got to know about the place, visitors from all walks of life started visiting the temple. And because of that, more facilities were put up to facilitate their visits. So fast forward to today, 10 years later, what we see now is a nice little temple that has become a tourist attraction. Small and simple compared to those elaborate temples in West Malaysia, it is interesting to note that when I visited the temple, there was no one on duty. I guess everything is based on trust. And visitors live up to their trust by keeping the place clean and proper. From that one initial statue, there are now many statues of the Buddha being placed in this cave. Other than being a temple, the natural formation of stalactites and stalemites forming various shapes as far as our imagination allow us to see, also serve as an attraction to visitors. As you walk up the stairs, Buddhist chants and music can be heard.
And finally, that's the golden statue of Buddha, the statue that brought to the founding of the cave temple in Sarawak. Thank you for watching this video.